In this video, we're going to create a message box using the jQuery UI. Now, what we want to do is create a message box that will pop up when we load our page. Now, we have to decide where we want to place our message box. And let's go ahead and we'll place it in our main content pane. We'll put it right in here. So let's go ahead and close this out. Now, you can see here I've created some code already. This, of course, is our main div section right here. And I've nested another div inside of it right here, this div. I've given it an ID of box. So all of this content in this div will be displayed in our message box. So again, that's why I've given this an ID of box. And then you can put basically whatever content you want. I put a paragraph here that just says, thank you for visiting our history site. And I've brought back Julius Caesar. We're going to use that image again. So let's go ahead and save this and let's go ahead and refresh our page. Now we're not going to create the message box yet. Let's just go ahead and see what this looks like. And there you can see the content is displayed in our main content pane. Now let's go ahead and create our message box. And we're gonna do that right down here. So let's just go ahead and copy and paste this code over again. And we need to specify our box ID right here. So let's go ahead and do that. And we don't need this argument anymore. This isn't going to be a vertical menu. And we just specify the dialog method. That is the main method that we need to call. So let's go ahead and save this. And let's go ahead and run this. And take a look at that. We got our message box. Isn't that pretty cool? And notice how all of the content is now displayed in the message box. The jQuery UI basically pulled all the content out of the main content pane and put that into our message box. That's how it works. So basically all of the content that we associated with that box ID is now placed inside this message box. And again, you can place whatever content you want in here. And actually let's go ahead and refresh this page real quick. That's a little strange. It looks like the border, the bottom border of our close button is actually bleeding here. That's interesting. That's actually a bug in the jQuery UI. I don't know if you guys are getting that too. That's really interesting. But if I move this around, so I clicked on another part of the page and it's gone. It's only when you're in focus on this message box that you get that. That's really strange. Let's actually load this in IE. This is a good test actually. And let's see if we have that same issue. And take a look at that, we didn't get it. That's interesting. So it's a bug with Chrome in the jQuery UI. Let's see if we get it in Firefox. And we didn't either, that's really interesting. In any event, now you know how to add a message box in the jQuery UI. Now there are many options with this and we'll talk about those in the next video. See you guys then.